Okay, cast heads, greetings and welcome to another cast heads show. Here with me, Nigel, and um, as always, we've got some really cool stuff for you uh, lined up to show you what we've got. But before we do that, I'm sure all of you by now have already heard of the Cast Hits magazine. If you haven't, you can go over to www.castitsmagazine.com and download our first issue. Our uh, second one is coming up and we are super excited with half the stuff that we've got ready for you. So please, please, if you like the magazine, the first one, come over to our Facebook page, Cast Hits Magazine and, uh, and um, sign up so that you get to know when the new one comes out. Uh, I'd also like to take this opportunity to thank quite a long list of people, uh, starting with Tarmac Works, they've been really influential and helpful. Uh, JL Hobby in uh, Malaysia, um, Collecti, our very own Oshan in Sri Lanka, um, as well as Green Light, uh, Collectibles, Hot Wheels, uh, True Scale Models, the list goes on. You'll see the whole list actually when you come to our webpage. Um, and it is absolutely fantastic. So come over to the Cast Heads webpage and uh, check out our first magazine and um, get ready for the next one. Uh, so today what we're going to do is one of our friends, good friends, Mr. Oshan from Collecti has given us one of these to review and this is a green light diorama. As you can see this is a Michelin brand one and uh, today we are going to take a look at this as well as uh, take some hot pictures with some green light vehicles. I've got some. I've got the new A-Team van, something that Collectique has a lot of. So if you are an A-Team fan, then we totally, totally suggest you get the A-Team van. Um, so we'll be checking that out today and putting it in this garage. So up next, the unboxing of green light collectibles weekend garage Michelin brand. There you have it. This is the Michelin Green Light Diorama Garage. It's quite cool. It's made out of die cast metal. It's got a detachable wall which you can slip into the side here. And as you can see, the wall has a nice uh, brick finish. Branded. Inside, we've got oil stains and cracks in the ground. We've got the workman's cupboard tool desk, a couple of posters. I'm sure you can dress this up yourself as well if you like. Uh, but what's really cool is it's got these garage doors that open up. I'm trying to be delicate here and don't want to break these nice toys that Oshan has given us to play with. Ah, there we go. You can see and this one also opens up here. Yeah, there you go. So you can take a picture of your garage inside. We've also got the green light 18 man which has spectacular detail while we're looking at that look at that it's the 18 green light van if you are a 18 fan then this is the van to get because it's got it is proper right down to the color scheme the lights on top everything this is this is fantastic and this is also available at the Oshan shop at collect collectic there you go fits perfectly in the high so this is basically a garage for 164 scale model so you can use your hot wheels or your green light collectible cars um in this instance of course i'm using my green light cars stick true to it uh, here's another nice one this is the uh, smoky and the bandit and what we can do is you can get the bonnet open there to get a very authentic garage look so as you can see, I mean this this is actually a great bit adult toy to play with, especially if you're into die cast collecting. Uh, tried to zoom in there, but the zoom didn't work too well. So we'll just tip that over and have a look at that close-up. There you go. Inside. Old American Trans Am leak underneath the Trans Am. I think this is a very nice piece. 
<laughs> For 5,500 bucks, it's pretty nice. Especially if you've got lots of space and you want to show off your 164s, you also make a great, great uh, piece for die cast of coffee. A bit more. Okay. Bandit's rear sticking out. Got some more cars. I think a red Ferrari would look perfect. There you go. Ready to get its groove on. So, that's the green light Michelin diorama. It's for sale. This is just one of them. Uh, Collectic has, an, has another one, which is a gas station. Pretty cool toys to have if you have the space and if you want to make your 164s look good. Definitely will up your game in uh, your diecast graphy. So, on that note, we're gonna close shop. We hope you enjoyed this installation of. Uh, Uh, Casted's vlog. I love saying that word vlog. And uh, next time, hopefully, we'll have not hopefully, but definitely, we will have some more new cool things um, to show you. Meanwhile, I would suggest you head over to Collectic and you get one of these dioramas and proudly display your Hot Wheels. That's it from us. Great time and take it easy.